Hello viewers, welcome to my channel, Stepping to Elia. I am Kavita Ramurthy. Today in this video, we are going to study about the, learn about how you can name the given number, a larger number through the international number system. So for that, what do you have to do? We have already seen in the previous video where how we can uh, name the larger number using the Indian number system. So now what is the difference between this Indian number system and the international system? It's very simple, but you should pay more concentration about uh, how you are going to name and what is the difference between these uh, Indian numbers and the uh, international number system. Now, just a small recap of that. Or oh, how about the... Indian system first. How about the Indian system we have learnt? It is nothing but, well, how can we say? Okay, we can say like this. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, ten lakh, crore, 10 crore is just a recap so I am just uh, making as fast as I can crore 10 crore and uh, 100 crore so this is how we are we have known to know about how to name the larger numbers using the Indian system and we also uh, just learnt about uh, how we are going to name uh, or putting the commas for example 8 9 4 3 2 6 1 0 so how we are going to put the commas first in the international system just a system just I am giving this recap children just to make the difference between the international and the Indian system so right to left 3 again 2 again 2 and then you have to put the place value and it will be for you to name it uh, very easily so this is how we see uh, in the previous video now what is that of international number system so how we are going to name like here we are going to start with the same of this ones tens hundreds thousand now watch me carefully ten thousand and hundred thousand ones tens hundreds thousand ten thousand hundred thousand and next starts the one million one million and comes the ten million and comes the hundred million and next comes the billion, 10 billion, 100 billion, comes the trillion, 10 trillion, 100 trillion. So this is how we can going to make this. And in this, what I'm going to say is just uh, by, by just comparing the Indian system and the international system, you can easily, you can easily name them. So let me take a fresh page and uh, I will just explain it to you. So first let us uh, name uh, how we are going to name the international number system. International number system. How we are going to name. So how you name that system? We started from ones, tens, hundreds, thousand. 10,000, watch me carefully, and comes the 100, 1,000, 10,000, and comes the 100,000, and again, 1 million, 10 million, 100 million, and goes on with the billion, 10 billion, hundred and it goes on like a trillion ten trillion hundred trillion so it goes on like that now what is the difference between this and before that we are going to do is uh, first know how we are going to put the commas let us take a number of a higher number like uh, four one three three uh, six eight one zero let this be like this now how you are going to put the commas is it's very easy in the international number system while comparing to Indian system both are easy but this is very easy now what in the Indian system I have told you first you have to put the commas from right to left uh, with of three digits okay and again and for international number system everything will be 
the commas will be only in between three numbers in between the three numbers okay so if you want to just uh, lengthen the number of eight four two how you are going to again put the commas like here as there is no number i'm not putting the comma here i'm just stopping it so this is how you are going to place the commas so children first know how to name or how to give the punctuation how to how you are going to give the comma for that number okay now shall we try for one more number so let the number be four two three zero two five seven eight Mm, six let it be now how you are going to put the comma using the international number system i told you it's a very simple for each and every three digit number that is from right to left you have to put the commas then it will be easier to name it now come on come on again come on again here there is no number so i'm not going to use the comma if there is some other number like one seven you can just put the comma here so three 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 so this is how you are going to put the commas for each and every three digit number and that too from right to left so never forget children it's very easy and how they are grouped here they have group they are being grouped and this ones tens hundreds are being grouped under the ones digit and this thousand ten thousand hundred thousand can be grouped in the thousand digit and one million ten million hundred million has been grouped under the million digits so this is how we are naming the numbers larger numbers using the international number system now shall we try or shall we just get into doing the sums by using the larger numbers okay let us take a number like uh, one four nine two six zero seven three uh, five let this be a number for example now how you are going to first you have to know whether we are going to dealing with the indian system or the international number system as we are studying about in this video only the international number system how you are going to do the commas from right to left and the two in the for Three digits for each and every three digit you are going to put the commas. Now come on five three seven here one comma and again zero six two here one comma and one two and three. It is already there is no more number so I am not using any commas. I just stop right there. So children now have you observed how I am using the commas to segregate them and now how we are going to put the place value. Now it's very easy. It is of ones, tens, hundreds. Thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand, and comes the million, ten million, and hundred million. Or if I want to show you a brief number, how can you write? As I have already told in the previous video, just give a gap, just give a space in between all the numbers as you are a training. So, just. Place the number like this. Now, how you are going to do? I know. Uh, you know how to give the commas for the international system. Now, now how you are going to name this? This is of ones, and this is of tens, and this is of hundreds, and this is of thousand, and this is of ten thousand, and this is of hundred thousand and what is this comes in the international so one million and this is ten million and this is of hundred million okay so if you want to put a, a tabular column like this you can like for each and every three digit you can have this so how they are placed over above all these ones tens hundreds are being named as the ones digit or the units digit all this thousand ten thousand hundred thousand has been placed under the thousand place value and this one million ten million hundred million are placed under the million digits so this is how we are going to name them so you can also know about whereas in the indian number system you are going to name out the lakhs and crores whereas here nothing so simply for each and every digit you have to put the commas and the digit and the how they are giving the place value like ones thousand and million so that is it now how we are going to name them shall we start naming them okay so first in order to that 
149. What is that? 149. So if you want to name this again, name ones, tens, hundreds. So 149. And what is the total digit value here? Million. So 149 million. And again, ones, tens, hundreds. So 260,000. 260,000. And again, one stands hundreds. 703 into 10, what is that? 30 plus 5, 35. 735. So you can you can easily see here million thousand and again here are offer the ones digit so ones thousand million so ones thousand million this is how we are going to name it so now what is the name for the given number one hundred and forty nine million two hundred and sixty thousand seven hundred and thirty five this is how we are going to name it so shall we have one more example so that it will be a great practice for you and it will be very easy to name the larger numbers come on one more trial. Now, let us take a number of this. 3, 2, 1, 4, 1, 5, 0, 1, 7. So, if they have just given the commas and if they have asked the question, it's, it's very easy to name them. Because using the commas, you can identify whether it is in the Indian system or in the international system. So, if you are asking without the commas, if they are given some number and if they asked you to name them through the international number system, the first step is keep it in mind, children, all those place values, all the chart you should keep it in mind. And now, first for the commas, how you are going to place the commas for each and every three digit from right to left, you are going to place the commas. So, come on, here, here, and nothing else there. So, I just leaving. So, if you want to name it, again, what I told you, just you can give a space for each and every number so that it will be easier for you to name it. Now, what is this place? It is in the ones place and it is in the tenths place and this is in the hundred place and this is in the thousand place and this is in the ten thousand place and this is in the hundred thousand place and this is in the one million and this is in the ten million and this is in the hundred million so this is how you can name and you have also know how to put the commas so now how you are going to name them i told you of it is of about three three and three so if you want to if you're having three numbers how are you, again you're going to know you know that ones tens hundreds so what is this 321 million so the number the number name is 321 million four again if you want to know what this is ones tens hundreds so what is this again four hundred and fifty thousand four hundred fifteen thousand and what is this i think you all know thousand again what is this if you are given three more numbers half ones tens hundreds and hundreds place there is nothing so what is this one into ten what is one ten sir ten ten plus seven is seventeen so three hundred twenty twenty one million four hundred fifteen thousand and seventeen so this is how you can name the given number so this is very simple for you children the only one thing you need to is just practice just as you can form your own number of yourself about of nine digit number and you can try to name it through the Indian system or the international system. Only that practice will give you that much confidence in handling these numbers or naming the numbers. So if you like this video, you can subscribe me, you can like the channel and share with your friends and whatever, whoever you like. So thank you.